This is a video laryngoscope, uh, very similar to our regular direct laryngoscope that we carry in our bags that most paramedics carry. Uh, this is now uh, a new video one that works in uh, relatively the same way except we have a video screen. It allows us to not have to do as much manipulation of the head, the neck, and the mouth in order to properly place an intubation tube into a patient's lung that's not breathing or having severe difficulty breathing. With this product now, I have the screen and I get it to where it needs to be and I can see the cords right here. So you see it was much quicker so by doing less manipulation of the head and the neck, especially in a trauma patient, it's going to be a lot safer for the patient. So this product is really about patient safety more than anything else, that we're able to provide a much safer interaction with our patients to be able to get the tube into their lungs quicker, especially since we're one of only a few services in the entire state that provides rapid sequence intubation. This is really a big safety concern for us to have something like this, especially with patients that we think may have a difficult airway. The Yukon Health Fire Department, we respond to over 3,000 emergencies a year, a predominant amount of those being medical emergencies in the field. So we have two of these, one is in our paramedic intercept vehicle, which is Rescue 2, which goes into the surrounding communities. And the other one is on Ambulance 1, which is the on-campus ambulance that responds to the medical emergencies. So by providing something that we can possibly do a safer technique for the patient and a quicker technique for that patient, it's really going to improve patient outcomes.